Not too sure what they got going on down here. But get a little footage. Two ambulances and a Boston EMS uh, supervisor just pulled off like two seconds ago. So, let's see, what, let's see what we got going on. Let's see what we got. Got the crime scene tape up there already, so the wagon just pulled out two seconds ago too. So just want to report what goes on in the city. Now this is um this is down in uh wow Fenway area, Park Drive area, um, one eleven Park Drive. So this this right here is a youth like a youth home. So I'm not too sure what took place. So we'll try to figure out what's going on. Get a little footage before I head up out of here. There's a time on it too. Pay attention to the time. You can go ahead. Go ahead. Thank you. There's a time on that sign, just so you know. She's not paying attention. There's, there's a time on that sign. Yeah, there's a, there's a time on it. She, she can go through there. It's not it's not 12 minutes yet. See, when you when you when you say something, you got to be correct. 12 midnight to 7, 6 a.m. That's the that's the sign. You got to know the streets. See, when you get, somebody gives you false information, you got to correct them on that. I don't like giving people false information. I had a couple of people give me false information the other day, and I had to correct them. With, with, with intelligence. You don't do it with ignorance. Do it with intelligence. 12 midnight to 6 a.m. The time right now is, um, just so you guys know, time right now is 7, 721. So she got plenty of time. It's not 12 midnight yet. Um, and these guys have an authority. Given a lot of police officers, they don't know. I, I try to educate them. I mean, a lot of these guys are pretty smart. So I help them out if I can. Now, this area here has a lot of issues. Because this is a group home. I don't know if you guys are aware of it. Right at the corner of Jersey and Park Drive, that's a group home right there where a lot of men stay. And they. They have quite a few issues that go on in there on a regular basis. Um, in the summertime, this is a little, a little hot area. Not not majorly hot, but it's it's hot enough. I mean, it has its it has its pros and cons. I'm not too sure what took place here, but I just want to give you guys some footage what's going on in the city. And it's always something. Something. How you doing? Right, somewhere there's a cell phone tower in this area. I just don't know where. One day I locate it, but there's a cell tower somewhere in this area. Um, what I think, I'm not sure on this one. I think this was a, a stabbing. I'm not 100% sure on this, so I could be wrong. Um, I let that's my buddy over there. He's pulled up, but there's a. I'm thinking it's a stab, and I'm not sure. Always something happening in the city. Of blood there. I don't know if you 
guys can make that out. It's, See some more droplets over there. Hmm. I'm not too sure exactly what transpired. Pretty good, pretty good leakage there. It's pretty. Now this is a. This is like an all men's like. Um, I guess you want to call this like a. Um, I, I don't want to call it a boarding home, but it's like one of those like youth homes for men. Like I can't get the proper name out. Maybe it's like a. It's like almost like a boarding home, but it's a. Like I said, there's always something going on in the city. It's always something. Okay, it's kind of like in the middle of the street there, but they'll probably correct it later on. How's, how's it going? So I just do security for a couple of these buildings. Are those two affected by whatever's going on over here? No, I just that. Awesome. All right, cool. Sounds good. Thanks, guys. Uh, this is one one of many events going on in the city at the same time. Just so you guys know, I was on the B3 side earlier. I had an issue going on over there. So, this, right now we're in the. I think this is the. This is this D4. I think this is D4 section. I believe this is D4. Either D4 or D11. I think it's D4 though. District District 4. Yeah. More cruisers pulling up. Um, I think they're going to be making an arrest up here. I think I think they have a questionable person inside that may be getting being brought out in handcuffs. Because I heard somebody say that the suspect is inside the building. So, I don't know if he's, he ran into this building, but allegedly, I want to say allegedly because I'm not sure. There's a lot of blood. I don't know if you guys can... The camera's still probably not picking it all up. But there's droplets there. There's some more droplets there. And as you go up the stairs, there's, there's more going up the stairs. So it's a good amount of blood. The victim has been taken to the hospital. I'm thinking they took him to bring him a woman. So I'm not sure on that. So don't quote me on that one. Could be wrong. I gotta find the name of this place here. This this is like a group home. I just don't know the actual name of this place, but uh, if I do find out, I put it in the um, the description. Uh, for the incident on Selden, I can apply you for the I number and the time it came in. Look like, it looks like blood over here, too. I don't know if you guys can see that. This, this right here looks like it's... Uh, sorry, can you go again with that? I I'm not going to hang out here too long, but I just want to give you guys a little bit of footage of what goes on in the city. 
Let's see. Let's give you guys a little glimpse of what's happening. Like I said, they may bring somebody out, they may not. But it's 50 50 chance. 50 50 chance on this one. If they got enough evidence to prove that that's, that's the guy who did the, the actual thing, chances are he may be getting arrested. So we're not too sure yet. And if they don't, then they might just have to just take you know, a statement and go from there. We'll see. One of my viewers will tell me the name of this building. I'm pretty sure they will. They, they just look up the corner of uh, Jersey Street and Park Drive. And, um, yeah, I wish they, they kind of gave you some power. Jersey Street's right there. And Jersey Street's a pretty hot street for, the, for this area. Something over there. Figure it out. In the summertime, there's usually you know, like a lot of young men hanging on these stairs right here. Uh, I'm not sure the capacity that they have inside the building, but it's usually a pretty decent sized group of young middle aged males that hang out here. tonight N E. They all everybody's busy tonight. Just gonna give you guys a little bit more footage yeah. of um I'm not sure what that car's doing either, but a lot of cars are doing weird stuff today. Like, it looks like it's an Uber. Of course. Oh, I'm going to show you just a little bit more footage of what happens in the city. Park Drive. That, so that's a state run facility. So I guess that's on the state police. Yeah, we're, we're in. We make contact to the individual who keeps going. Okay, I got it, yeah. Okay, Bravo 3. Uh, Bravo 3, Bravo 3, Bravo 3. 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 Bravo Okay. 
So this is going to be on the state police. So they're, they're going to wait for the state police to... Uh, Yankee Bravo 3. Yankee Bravo 3. Yeah, Cap, that's the Brook House, correct? Yes, it is. Okay. Just found out the name of it already, the Brook House. See how easy was that was? They have to even look at it. I heard that name before, too. So they must have got more than one location. Must have got more than one location because I definitely heard of the Brook House before. Delta 431. All right, so. 431. I'm not going to sting over here too long. Yes, I'm clear from that Boylston call. You want to send down um, that St. Germain? Okay, Charlie Robert, the last I'll send you down St. Germain. Thank you. So this is D4. D4 and a. Well, just because it says D4 doesn't mean it is D4, but I'm assuming it is D4. Yeah, it must be D4, because all these cars say D4. I I, just gotta, I don't know exactly where they separate D4 from D11, but there's a grid that shows where the areas separate. I think D11 is more like Brighton area. And water, like going towards Watertown, that area. I could be wrong. Charlie, 113, 113, I have an L20. Alright, guys, I gotta head up out of here, but I just wanna give you a little footage, because any minute my phone's gonna be ringing, because I do have a destination to be at. Try to give as much footage as I possibly can get. Usually state police are like right, uh, not, not over there too. Usually they're sitting right, uh, he's not there. Usually there's a state trooper that's right over the corner down there. But there's nobody there today. So that's so it's on the state. So that means the state's probably going to have to handle the. Uh, At nine ten, sir. They're trying to get in contact now. They'll call me back with an ETA. Thank you. It's interesting. I'm going to ask the 26 of the units that responded to Selden Street. Can I just get a confirmation that they copy? Mm. Mm. All right, 26 is from anyone that responded to Selden Street. That's another incident they had on um, on the sea well, on the seaside of um, of Bravo. Well, much else to report over here other than the fact they may be arresting somebody inside um, I guess they're gonna wait for the arrival of state police and see how they deal with that situation um, uh, 983 yeah we had more than two rappers respond there I have to go through the bad but um, we're gonna need those by the end of the tour if they can't respond then we'll just we'll seek them out Okay, anyone who responded up to that cell to the you make yourself known now. Acknowledge the fact you have to write a 26 before the end of the tour. Charlie, for a minute, I had it. 425S.
107, I'll, I'll do one. So I'm gonna head up out of here, guys. I keep saying that, but it's a well being check over the nine minor street. If anything else comes up, I'll Ohio be sure to report back to you guys. But as far as we know, state police is gonna be should be on their way. Okay. Usually, usually, there's one at the end of Park Drive down there, but I don't Probably see him bad. there today. So maybe he's took the took the night off. Um, it's good to know that that's called the, the Brook House, because I never knew the name of that place. city. I'll be sure to come back and post another video before the night's out because the night is young and there's a lot of stuff going on in the city. And um, matter of fact, this, this, This is the only area where you find a lot of light. That's only because that's a um, one of those five five G antennas up there. Just gonna take a walk down the street and see what else is going on in the city. going on down here so it looks like I'm gonna I'm gonna get to the next Tango 351 Tango 10 more please 10 more squares alright till next time guys I'm Nez Porter I'll be sure to catch you on the next one no GPS information on it been good at this time Sarge I just have one removal pending